Hello Internet, Adopted Mike here, and this is kind of one of those where have I been videos. I've still been responding to a lot of the comments in my videos and questions and stuff like that, but uh, I unfortunately recently, well I guess not recently anymore, it's been, uh, this was in May and this video was being shot in September, I had a house fire uh, which kind of put me out of my home, so now I'm in my uh, temporary office I guess if you will. And this is my first video from um, being gone, I guess. So it's been quite a while, unfortunately. It took me a little while to get uh, back on my feet and get my setup going again. Uh, this, my computer stuff is not my full-time job. It definitely, uh, I love it, but uh, I don't do it for a living. So I lost a lot of my stuff and I had to replace it and go from there. So anyway, here we are today, finally. Um, I got some video of after the fire that uh, I want to show um, kind of what fire can do and you know some of the important things uh, to to note I guess um, it definitely is unforgiving so uh, you can't fight it you can't um, stop it by the time I woke up in the morning, it was out of control, and um, we were lucky to escape with our lives, my wife and I. Um, we don't have any children, just our pets, uh, but we were able to get everything out of the house. Um, the fire department was able to save most of the house. We lost about, maybe about half of the house. The rest of it, severely smoke damage, and uh, smoke damage didn't do very well to the electronics, um, so... I did end up losing most of my computers and most of my gadgets and stuff like that. Uh, all of that can be replaced. That wasn't a huge deal there. I mean, the not losing your life was kind of a <laughs> was definitely the the uh, the good thing. Um, it happened pretty fast. Woke up about a little before five o'clock in the morning, um, and everything was going, and uh, we were just able to escape with a few things and we lost like the garage is where it started so we lost all of that and then the smoke damage that came into the house was, was pretty uh, was pretty bad as you can see in some of the shots here it uh, definitely uh, everything was kind of black everything was coated in this um, you know the smoke made kind of a almost a oily type residue it left on a lot of stuff and from what I understand, it just kind of eats away at the electronics. So uh, the insurance company and the cleaning company actually suggested that we just ditch all the electronics and replace them, uh, you know, because there's no guarantee on anything when it gets coated in that kind of that residue. Um, it, there's a couple of the computers that were close to the fire that I had, and those did not fare well at all. Um, you see with some of the video that I shot, we can get kind of an idea of what's uh, what's going on here, but um, we can look at uh, these computers here and you can just kind of see that they're just hashed. This uh, was actually in the laundry room. These were customers computers that I had that I was working on and some that I had just recently built to sell and they got it got pretty warm in the laundry room it was stopped shortly like right in this particular area that the video is right now um, and uh, kind of a laundry room but it's where I had some storage of stuff that was about to go out the door to the customer so it just completely ruined the uh, computers in here and then um, as we move around a bit you can just see the absolute devastation uh, that the heat of the fire will do. And then we move into what was my office. Um, we've moved some of the things out at this point of the video, but most of it, about half, well, half or more of it is still there. Um, as I take this shot here, uh, the shot's not that good, unfortunately. I was taking it with my, uh, my smartphone, so it's not the best quality. And the lighting is piss poor as well, too, but you can kind of get the general idea of uh, the devastation. This is just smoke damage. There was actually no fire in this room at all. So 
So anyway, that's what I've been up to. I'm not a huge fan of the what have I been up to videos or why I haven't shot a video in a while. I'm not a huge fan of those, but I figured I could throw one out there so everybody could kind of understand what happened and uh, hopefully at this point um, that uh, I can get back into shooting some videos here and there and some doing some uh, tech stuff and some more computer builds and kind of try to get my life back together. I'll be out of my home for, you know, it'll end up being probably a year by the time we get back in there. Uh, it was quite, quite a lot of damage, unfortunately. And uh, so that puts us, you know, next year. So for right now, I'm in my temporary office space here. It's a lot smaller, but uh, what do you do, you know? It could be a lot worse. Like I said in, uh, a little bit ago, it is, uh, we're alive, I'm alive, and everything is good. So, uh, fire is pretty devastating. I know, um, like, uh, I was watching Austin Evans. Uh, he had a fire um, a while back now, but, you know, thinking, uh, wow, how, what is that like? Well, now that I know what it's like, it's, Pretty, uh, it's kind of crazy, it is. It's uh, definitely, definitely not something that I want to do again. But uh, hopefully everything gets squared away and I can put my uh, life back together. And other than that, um, you know, that's kind of where I've been and what I've been up to. And I haven't disappeared, I haven't given up. Um, so now uh, hopefully I can uh, get back to making videos and uh, doing uh, doing that again because it is what I enjoy so um, anyway as always thanks for watching <laughs>